The next question, the member for Cambridge. Hey, hey. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My question is for the Minister of Tourism, Culture and Sport. The film production industry has been a major success story in Cambridge. And we welcome the tremendous economic injection into our local economy from domestic and foreign film productions. Nearly $900,000 was brought in just last year. Wow. One production that has been filmed here since its first season is The Handmaiden's Tale, uh, which became Cambridge's unofficial claim to fame on the small screen. While viewers greatly enjoy this show as it wraps up its final season, local businesses in my community greatly benefited from the production and the work completed here. Speaker, can the minister please explain how our government is supporting the film industry in Ontario, especially in communities like mine with new film and, question. and cinema production opportunities? Great question. <laughs> Mr. Of Tourism. Uh, Mr. Speaker, you bet I can. Um, <laughs> and that's a great question. And I also appreciate uh, the member recognizing what happens in, within his community when the film and television industry comes in, not for a visit, but to do their work, stay for a while, and the ripple effect is positive for everybody. So thank you for noticing. Uh, the film and television production industries continues to thrive. In, and I, some people might say to me, as they have before, thrive, how could they have thrived? Well, let me tell you. Uh, in 2022, it was the best year ever. Hard to believe. But that goes to show you what a great industry it is. It is thriving, as I said, and it has wonderful people driving the bus. Highest productions ever, ever. Uh, I don't like to say numbers, but I will say it's over $3 billion back in the economy, 46,000 jobs. This is an industry, Mr. Speaker, that's moving forward aggressively. Thank you very much. And the supplementary question. Thank you to, to the minister for that response. Speaker, And it's positive that our government is committed to making these target investments in Ontario's growing film and television sector. But what, is there more that can be done to solidify Ontario's uh, position as a first-rate center for film and television production? Besides enjoying annual growth of this industry and the benefits to our economy, the people of Ontario expect our government to ensure we have a permanent foundation for homegrown film and television industries. Speaker, can the minister please elaborate on the outlook for the film and television industry in Ontario? Thank you. Minister of Tourism, Culture and Sport. Um, uh, again, Mr. Speaker, thank you for the question. Um, well, we, we're not as reliant on international productions as we used to be. It was up domestic film and television production production was up 25% last year. Confidence in Ontario was right. Yeah, go ahead. That's a 25% is a big deal. Uh, confidence isn't just within Ontario. It's from outside of Ontario as well. Uh, there is a very large, may I say massive, production studio being built 1.2 million square feet in Markham, Ontario. <clears throat> it's being done by a gentleman who grew up in Canada who's a star in the film industry, Ryan Reynolds. His company is building this. So there's more than just a few people, Mr. Speaker, that has confidence in Ontario and what they're doing. On top of which, response. You betcha. Driving jobs, driving revenue, good paying careers for people down the road in this industry. Great opportunity for young people, Mr. Speaker. Thank you.